I think how you feel about this projector will depend largely on what you use it for. As a 4K video projector, and for the price, it is a reasonably good deal. I picked my 3200 up on sale at Best Buy. You will find the contrast unsatisfactory for dark scenes unless you have a blacked out, light controlled room. Of course, good contrast always requires a blacked out room, but even so, the blacks on this are dark gray. For example, when playing Assassin's Creed Origins, I cannot see my way around a crypt without having all other lights in the room off. HDR is not very noticeable, but is adjustable. You will notice the auto iris kick in a moment after scene changes sometimes. This is Epson's attempt to make up for the lower contrast levels of this projector. I can live with this, happily, if the projector is only used for video. The projector is incredibly bright. No issues there. The crappy contrast may go unnoticed in a room without light control. In my basement, with no windows, I find it very bright in eco mode, even nearly 1000 hours in. The lens shift feature blew my mind, and hugely simplifies installation without having to mess with keystone correction, which leaves the trapezoidal gray, black light around your picture. The worst part of. With video you may not notice, but since I've been working from home for the last few months of COVID, I use this as a 142 inches monitor for programming, several hours a day every day. It is underscore impossible underscore to get even focus across the screen with text. You can have one area sharp and another area dreadfully blurry, or you can have the entire thing slightly out of focus and rub your eyes all day long. Lest you think it may be caused by imperfections in my screen, or not having the projector perfectly centered. I can put a piece of paper in the out of focus area and walk back towards the projector 4 to 5 feet before that text is in focus. So, it ISNT due to flatness of the screen. Tech support. Epson tech support has been good. When I finally bought and mounted a screen to verify it wasn't due to my uneven wall, they happily replaced my projector with a refurbished one via two-day FedEx, prepaid both ways. Unfortunately, the refurb was even worse for focus issues and had light scratches on the lens, so they overnighting a brand new one. The focus issue persists, so it seems to be common for this line, or my setup is inexplicably wrong somehow. Epson does not have a way to trade in, upgrade to something better, so I'll probably have to try to sell it on my own and take a loss. So, overall, acceptable for the price for movie night. Not acceptable for computer work. If you can afford to spend a little more for something closer to true 4K, with better focus and contrast, I do recommend doing so. Update asterisk I have been ceiling mounting this projector to keep it out of the way of people and reduce shadows from the same. The lens shift that was so delightful, seems to be a contributor to the focus issue. Switching to keystone correction instead of lens shift helps the focus, but it is still an issue. Also, keystone correction throws off the aspect ratio so the image no longer fits the screen, it's either too wide, or I have to leave small dark strips at the top and bottom of the image. Finally, I unmounted the projector, put it in tabletop mode, and stacked boxes under it so the image is perfectly centered with no keystone and no lens shift. The center is stunning, but the side is still out of focus. I've included a couple pictures from the panel alignment mode to show the focus difference from center to top right, tabletop mode, when the projector is perfectly centered on a flat, professional screen. This review is not going to cover all the statistical information for this projector. 
that been covered. I'm going to do an unfair comparison of this projector, and the Epson 5050, Pro model, which costs nearly three times as much, and I also happen to really like. So here goes. The 5050 has a striking image quality, long lamp life, and digital image tuning. With the remote you can dial in the image, as far as zoom, sharpness, and image, screen orientation. Click link in description for purchase and more reviews.